In today's video, I'm going to be taking a trip down memory lane. Hey everyone, it is Patrick Ta, and welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to do something a little bit more different. I'm going to be taking a trip down memory lane, and basically what I'm doing today is that I'm going to be reminiscing freshman year. So I will be getting to what that is. I'm going to give a shout out to Nicole Lano, who is a really, really cool YouTuber that inspired me to do this kind of video, because in her video she did senior boxes, which basically means that she basically put like a lot of collectibles and memories in a box for senior year to reminisce senior year so i decided to do the same but freshman year edition so i have a box that you probably saw in the thumbnail i have a box and i put freshman year on it it's not really well decorated but this is gonna be my freshman year box i'm just gonna be reminiscing freshman year and see what's inside and just show y'all what's inside of it and what i put in this box that have a lot of really good memories inside so yeah let's just get started with this video and Taking a trip down memory lane. Let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna be opening the box right now. Actually, no, I might start with like a little bit more of like other stuff first, like the big stuff. All right, so these two dragons I got for my birthday party. I had my birthday party at main event. It was my first time having a birthday party with like actual friends in such a long time. I had an amazing day, a blast. And I got these two dragons from the gift shop. And actually one of my friends, Johnny, he actually gave me his card with all the points on it. And he gave me it so I could buy these dragons. I have a picture of me and him hugging, but I really am grateful for that and these dragons have been in my room ever since and I love these dragons so much, they're so so cute and I'll probably keep it <laughs> and also I have this my hug pillow that my, my friend Sephora got me for my birthday it's a hug pillow and it's very very cute, it has been sitting on my chair and I hug it all the time and it's very very cute so shout out to Sephora and also Johnny if I haven't said that already and I think that's all for all the big stuff now I just have all the stuff that's in here Freshman year, yeah, okay, I'm gonna be opening it and see, yeah, this is everything. That is a lot of stuff in there. I was actually not expecting to be a lot of stuff in this box because I didn't really realize I have a lot of stuff from this year, but this, is, this isn't this is just school stuff. It's also like stuff that I did in the entire freshman year. So I'm gonna be showing y'all. This is a bubble verse. Yep, yeah, there it is. Yeah, and then I got this from a retreat that I went to for church and it has like a prayer on the back of it and stuff like that. This is my confirmation card that I had for whenever I had confirmation. Basically, confirmation is a sacrament in Catholicism. And basically, I got confirmed. And basically, you just become closer to the church with the Holy Spirit. And I had, this was my name tag. This is my Vietnamese name. And my confirmation saint was Paul, St. Paul. So I, I kept it because it was very, very special to me. This is a cross that I received from uh, a retreat, which I will be mentioning later. This is the cross that I got. It probably needs to be on my neck. <laughs> this is a prayer card to St. Dominic Xavier that I got from my church also. This is uh, another name tag that I got from a retreat that I went to from my church. And this is a rosary that I got from one of my retreats also. I went to a lot of trip retreats this year. Oh yeah, this is the coaster that I got from the Cinema Roll Sweet Cafe that I went to in Korea. I kept these coasters. I put one in here because it was such an amazing time in Korea. I really want to go again to Korea. And it's just very, very cute. So... Yeah, this is the coaster. Oh yes, this one. This one's a really good one. This one is the Guts World Tour card that I got from the tour that I went to in March. Yeah, this is the card. Yeah, and that's it. And I'm actually wearing my merch that I got from her. It's very, very comfy. Shout out to Olivia Rodrigo. I love the merch. Um, I love the merch. And my siblings got it for me. So shout out to my siblings. I love you all. This is my spring concert pamphlet that I kept. I love all this. I kept a lot of the merch that my mom made for me. for Like, because she loves making me merch for my channel. So this is one of it. It's like a notebook. It says, I just plan it. My top of chili beans. Subscribe. And it even has its own pen. And I probably should be using this already. It's very, very cute, and I need to be using this because I love my mom. Okay, there's contact. So basically, in the school year, I don't know why, but at the, like, basically at the end of the month, the last few months of the school year, I kept getting notes inside my locker, sticky notes inside my locker. People were saying they had a, they had a crush on me in my, in my locker. I have no idea. But I think this might be from Sophie. This one, it says, I love you, bestie. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like it might be from Sophie. I feel like I might, what it probably was. I don't really know, but 
I have all these sticky notes from my locker. It was so funny, but it was also really, really weird. It was, I don't even know. I can't like literally all the crushes notes in this because I don't know where else to keep it. And it's also really funny. This is a wristband that I got from a retreat called DCYC. I kept it because why not? Oh man, I really missed it. Okay, this is my lanyard and my car from when I went to DCYC, which stands for Dallas Catholic Youth Conference. I went down to Dallas and I went to DCYC. I had a blast there and I still kept my thing because I wanted to keep it. And this also came to DCYC, someone gave it to me. This is the name tag from whenever I volunteered at my mom's organization. My mom's 5k run, so she has a non-profit organization called St. Constantine Outreach. And we raise money for the orphans in Vietnam. But yeah, this is the volunteer name tag that I got from volunteering at the 5k run, which was very, very cool. <laughs> yeah, these are gummy bears that I still kept in DCYC. Some guy gave this to me and I still have it. I don't even know what's good anymore. <laughs> I have another cup of it. Another rosary that I got from, I think, BCYC or another place. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of these. Ooh, this is a good one. <laughs> my friend Noelle got me this for my birthday. And she got me a 1989 Taylor Swift version CD. I've never owned, like, actual Taylor Swift merch before. And this was very, very cool. I love Taylor Swift and it's just such a good present. So thank you, Noelle, if you're watching this. I recently did a project in history about the Vietnam War and I had to ask my grandma some questions about it and she answered it on this piece of paper in Vietnamese and I kept it because I just want to keep it for my grandma because it's very, very cool and stuff like that. This is a auto server, but it's like a whole thing. I think in May, I got this because I was an auto server and it was at the end of the year and they gave us all this for the auto server. Yeah, it was on our feast day of the auto servers. Yeah, and I got this, so. That's very nice. Actually, I'm gonna keep it up here. It was already up here anyway. That's, what else do I have? Oh yeah, I don't know why. I kept this. This is like a whole drawing that my friend Kaylee got me to color with her and I never did it. <laughs> because I was so busy, but I don't even think she knows anymore. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is my schedule. This is a schedule for like culture week at my school. Oh yeah, my friend Danny gave me this, I think, and it says Patty Fan Art. I go by Patty. My nickname is Patty. Literally everybody calls me Patty. I don't, no one really calls me Patrick anymore. Um, I go by Patty, and someone made this for me, Patty Fan Art Anonymous, and it's me in uniform with my jacket on, my green jacket that I always wore. Anonymous is very, very cute, and I kept it. Another crush note, another one <laughs> on a gum wrapper. I don't know whose idea was that. Oh my gosh. Another... I, I have so many sticky notes saying about like getting uh, having a crush on me. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, and I kept all okay, all these sticky notes I kept okay, me and Sophie, if you don't know, Sophie is like my best best friend ever and we had one class together which was science and we were sitting like really really close to each other. And we were actually sitting next to each other for like two quarters and then we had to switch seats, which is whatever. He, she was sitting right, right behind me, so we were we were literally passing notes, like our, all of our inside jokes and it's just very very funny and they kept them all because it's just like such a special thing to keep. I have like all this stuff, Abby Lee Miller stuff, Vance Mom stuff, I don't know why, it's just, it's just such a funny thing to keep, but I just love it. All the inside, inside jokes, oh my gosh, I have so much, okay. Oh, yeah, this is another crush note. Dear Patrick, I think you are very, very cute, blah, 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 blah. I don't even know. Like, all these crushes notes are probably, like, a joke, but I just, it's so funny. Whenever I was, like, really, really, like, bored in class, I would, like, take out an index card and, like, write what, what was on my mind. So I just wrote, like, so many Taylor Swift songs on this index card from Debut and Fearless. I don't know, I, I was just so bored and I just wrote a lot of songs. So, my friend made this for me. Kaylee, Maddie, or Sophie, I don't know whoever made this, but I should know this. Like, they literally sat next to me, but they made this for me. I forgot who made it. I'm so sorry, but I love this. I love this so much. So cute. This was Valerie's invitation to her quinceanera, and I was invited, and that's on my channel. I have, I made, like, a whole video about that, which is very, very cool, and I loved it a lot. <laughs> so, probably from Sophie. <laughs> oh my gosh. And this, this, this was in my binder, and I didn't find it for, like, weeks until I saw this, so it's really, really funny. I have a lot of stickers from, I believe, I got from DCYC or another retreat. Oh yeah, this is Getaway Car with Taylor Swift, The Bridge. I love it so much. I just wrote it down because why not? I wrote like all like the beginning verses of Taylor Swift's 1989 album. I wrote all like the first verses on it. I don't know why. But this is actually like an old car and everybody like doing science thing. And I just kept it because I, I don't know. I don't know when we need it later. Oh my gosh. I wrote the lyrics for What Was I Made For by Billie Eilish. I don't know why. It was just, I needed to write it down. This was a meme that I wrote down. It says, 
talented, brilliant, incredible, amazing, so sorry, this is like a never the same, totally unique, when I've read them before. I don't read the reference or not reference. If y'all know that meme, comment down below, because it's like very, very funny. I wrote more first verses like Taylor Swift's 1989 album. I don't know why I wrote so many of these. Oh, more inside jokes from Sophie and I. Oh, another one of these. I believe Kaylee made this for me, I think. I'm sorry if I don't know who it is, but I think Kaylee made this for me. I really wish I wrote the person who wrote, who wrote that. More inside jokes from Sophie. More inside jokes. It's, this one says, we're going to the house of Raquel. What's house of Raquel? Roll those R's. And then that darn go to Trump who felt like, this is just a really inside joke for me and Sophie. Oh my gosh. And what is this? Dear Patrick, I love you for a long time. <laughs> Another crush note. Oh my gosh. I don't know who wrote all this for me. My gosh. Inside joke. Okay, so basically my literature and history teacher, she would literally make like these like cookies and they were so good. And I wrote down the recipe for it. Shout out to Miss Waggy. I love your cookies so much and I'll probably bake these if I have the time. Uh, I missed that. This is a sticky note list for my birthday party, whoever was coming. This is like a sticky note for whenever my mom had to sign for my geometry homework for homework. Didn't get in trouble, didn't get any bad grades. You just have to sign it. And another one of these. Love this a lot. Kept everything. Oh my gosh. All these yellow sticky notes are pretty sure are from Sophie. Like, I, they're all like stuck together. I kept a lot of inside jokes. And this is how much we wrote. I don't know why I have so much. Ooh, this is a good one. This is my Patrick's Planet pen. And this is the, the first merch that I ever made. Thank you to my mom because my mom makes all my merch. This is a four color pen and I made it for my friends and this needed to be in this box because it was like highlight of my freshman year. Yeah. My merch pen. Oh yes, this is a good one. I kept my solar eclipse glasses whenever the solar eclipse came by and I was able to see it. I got some good pictures and yeah, I just need to keep these because like that's not going to happen for like a long, long time. More crush notes another eclipse classes because i wanted to keep it this heart thing that I was on the floor and i kept it <laughs> this is a egg that i think my friend marcus gave me and i just kept it because i don't know why i just kept it oh i remember this okay this was whenever an in and out food truck came to our school and the ticket was in here i just kept it more and more crush notes so many <laughs> so many oh my gosh why how why are there so many I didn't realize I had this much. Oh yeah, this is whenever I came up with the idea of making like a new like outro for myself. Don't forget to smell and have a scrum the lump just day. Bye. So I wrote this on here. That was the beginning of my new outro kind of. This bow, I believe. I think my friend Marcus also made this. He put it in my locker. This was a, I believe it's a crane. I think my friend Giselle made this for me. She put it on my head and I just kept it. This is a really bad straw. This is a straw that we use in a science lab and I kept it because everybody was wanted to keep it and stuff like that so i just kept it Ooh, okay this is a rubber ducky i forgot to put this in my video but basically in the beginning of the weekend before finals the seniors did a prank so senior prank is like a yearly tradition so basically they put rubber duckies in everyone's lockers and like put like a little like marker face on the locker basically for everyone's lockers so i kept one of my rubber duckies and i was really really lucky to keep it because all the teachers were making us like give it to them but i put mine in my locker so they wanted to Oh yeah, okay. This is whenever I went to Sophie's birthday party. I took these pictures and I love these kind of pictures. And also from one of my family's weddings, got these pictures from my family and my cousins. They're very nice. More pictures from Sophie's birthday party, which I love. More from my family's wedding. Oh my gosh, so many sticky notes. A lot more from Inside Joe's probably from Sophie. It was like another, it was like a root beer float truck, I'm pretty sure. And I kept one of the pens from them because I just stole it from them and I never give it back. More Inside Joe's from Sophie. Yeah, I don't, I don't even know. I need to count how much Inside Jokes me and Sophie did. Oh my gosh. Um, more, 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 more sticky notes, more sticky notes. Oh yeah, this was whenever I just posted this video today. This is the fortune that I got from my fortune cookie that I received in LA whenever I was traveling back from Vietnam and I kept the fortune. Yeah, and it says, you're always there for a friend in need from Pan Express. Oh yeah, this is another crush note. Oh my gosh, I received so many. This is another merch pen that my mom made for me. It's like, I just pen it, my top of jelly beans, subscribe, all that stuff. And the last things I have in here are actually my school ID. So that says Patrick Tall, and that's me. This is my 8th grade ID. And for half of the school year, we were using these IDs to get school lunch. But then after our yearbook pictures came in, they made like a new ID for us. So this is my 9th grade one. Yeah, that's me, Patrick Tall. 
And that's me. That is all. That is my freshman year box. Oh, man. Okay, I need to put this all back. So that is all that is my box. And I hope you guys enjoyed what was in this box. And it was very, very nice for me to go down memory lane and reminisce all this memories from freshman year. I will try to do this every single year of high school so that I can continue this tradition, I guess. Thank you so much again to Nicole Lena for inspiring me to do this kind of video. It was very, very fun and I'm glad I kept all this stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching Top Fam and the Chili Kids course. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on post the notification make sure you're notified it's every single video that I post and yeah I love you guys so much and don't forget to smile and have a scrum daily on this day bye guys